Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So we are filming, or I say we like the raw we, but I am filming in my bedroom today. House is still a tip and to be honest, the boys are out there, husband's out there, so I've just shut everybody out so I can quickly do this video. I wanted to show you my updated evening routine. It's, what time is it? Let's have a look. It's half past four, so it's not quite evening here, but I get ready slightly earlier and especially today because I just want to chill out. I'm not wearing any makeup, as you can tell. <laughs> no makeup on today yeah i just don't always wear makeup so i wear makeup if i'm going to work or if i'm doing anything but today's been a home day haven't needed to put makeup on so i try to give my skin a break especially since i am trying this new skincare routine i mean everything's the same i've got a new cleanser that i've been using i'm using two different types of cleansers now but I've introduced Dermatica, which is my new kind of treatment plan. So I'm being careful not to introduce anything else at the moment and just to see how that goes and to give my skin a break. So I've definitely noticed a few kind of extra blemishes and small kind of blemishes that have, I mean, the dark eyes are because I've just recovered from being ill and having bronchitis. So that's not Dermatica, that's just being ill. But a few blemishes and things that have come out and they said that would happen. There's kind of a lot of steps that comes with it in terms of what to expect. But somewhere, I think it's on here actually, let's have a little look. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, here we go. Yes, what to expect during your treatment. And it does so from weeks two to three, although I find I get it sooner breakouts just because I do react to products. So I'm doing it carefully and I'll explain more in a minute, but some small breakouts is normal. So that's fine. But yeah, I thought I'd just do a quick updated routine, show you what I'm using at the moment. So let's get going. So. My first one, and usually it's really good at taking makeup off if I have any, eye makeup, etc. You can work this directly in into your eye line, um, mascara, everything, it's fine, doesn't sting or anything. I haven't found I had any problems myself. So I use this one here, which is the Japan Fusion from Beauty Pie. I still use quite a lot of Beauty Pie products. I do love using them. They're just a really good price, really good product. And I like I said, I found this one works really well for me. I don't have any kind of reaction issues. It's a very milky consistency. Let's see if I can get it out. There we are so i use a pea size amount so not too much if i was just using that one which i was previously before introducing another cleanser then i would do this and then another one after and today it's just to obviously break down any grime and dirt from the day and i've been so organized and already have my hair out of my face god i really hope my dark eyes recover in a couple of couple of weeks it has been a miserable few weeks of being sick. Everybody in the house got sick. And then, of course, pass it to me as the last person and I've got it worse. So, which is just really fun. So I just do that. I have a wet flannel, which is here, which, oh my God, I can tell all this one has got mascara on it. I wash these. So I have about 50 different bamboo ones that I've got over time. These are actually the ones I used to get from Tropic Skincare, which is another brand I love. I just couldn't afford it anymore. I was spending, I mean, because of all the serums, which are about £40, a, you know, a pot or a jar, I was spending an incredible amount of money on them. So I decided, and that's when I tried to look at Beauty Pie. God, what's, this is awful, really dark eyes. I don't normally have eyes like this. This is dreadful. This is because I'm so tired. I have got next week of work though, so hopefully some sleep will really help with it. Or I'm just in preparation for Halloween, which is a few days away. So maybe that's what it is. So I just wipe it off. But yeah, Beauty Pie has been my replacement for Tropics. Obviously, they're not going to be comparable. And I do love Tropic skincare, but I just couldn't justify the cost anymore. I'm a mum and money's tight sometimes. So Beauty Pie has been a godsend for me. So I do one of those, just wiping it off with a wet flannel. And then I this is the new one, which actually, I think, who gave this to me? It was my mum because she tried this one she's had a few different ones she has the same one as I do the pink Japan fusion and then she tried this cleanser as well which is plant tastic again by beauty pie this one is an apricot butter cleansing balm they are completely different and I don't know if I'm doing it in the right order maybe you should do the oil one first then the cream one I don't really know someone who's cleverer than me might figure that one out but I don't know I just have got used to doing it in a certain way this one does as well you don't have to use kind of a flannel or a you know a wipe or anything usually if I'm in the shower I'll do this and I'll just use the water I don't use a cloth at all and it all comes off so and it turns really milky milky consistency that one so this is the apricot one which comes in here nice big pot 
like I said, my mum gave it to me because she didn't need it. Um, so I've been using this. And I will say it does smell really good. The Japan Fusion one doesn't really have a scent. This one is really, well, it's apricot. So it smells really nice. I use a really small amount because it is oil based. It's got uh, cold pressed rose hip oil and vitamin E in it. So it's really nice. I just use a really small amount and I just warm it between my fingers first. Like so. Which again, I am by no means a beautician or a skincare expert. And I'm probably rubbing this in wrong and being aggressive with my skin, but honestly, this is as good as it gets for me. So don't be screaming on the other end, freaking out about my skin. It's okay. We're all right. I tried to get under here because sometimes like, if I did put makeup down there, and I have got like a little friend coming up there, but hey ho. Um, this one, however, I have, I am also looking over here just because it's clearer for me to see what I'm doing, but I'm still here. This one, dusting your eyes. So. I think that's also why I've not done it first because when I'm trying to get my mascara off I'm using the Japan Fusion that you can really work into your waterline that doesn't hurt at all or sting whereas this plantastic one I find it does sting your eyes a little bit I have got dry eyes though so whether it's because I'm sensitive but it stings a little so as you can see so I'm just going to wipe that off with my roots that are growing through I'm getting my hair done I think in three weeks now so which is good this is attractive, isn't it? <laughs> How do you make this look less like this? Oh, yeah, yeah. So wiping it all off. And again, some people won't. Yeah, I don't know. Skin is a really personal thing. For me, I quite enjoy using a bamboo cloth. That's like my natural form of exfoliation. I mean, they'll call it manual exfoliation, won't they? It's not natural, but you know. Just doing a quick wipe with a bamboo cloth, which goes through the wash and, you know, saving the environment. But also, there we go. Okay. I'm going to stop waffling on that one. So that is me all cleansed. So that is sorted. Those two away. And then honestly, before I was using the Damascus, I was just using vitamin C serum from, again, it's in my previous video, again, from Beauty Pie. I think it's called Healthy Skin comes in a similar pot to this with a pump action it's a vitamin c one and that was all i used in the evening and then i popped this plantastic again in the same range which is an overnight miracle face oil i use that after but now that i'm using dermatica i've dropped the vitamin c from beauty pie and instead i've moved to my dermatica which is this little one here this comes once a month comes in a little package like this I won't show you my dress but all the dress to yourself in here you open it up and then it has your instructions that come inside it gives you a little bit of information here your instructions and then your prescription which is over here and then this is the little tube that was inside so i'm gonna read it because i have a habit of forgetting things properly and trying to explain it properly so this is probably gonna make more sense if i read it which i wrote the other day so dermatica provide personalized skincare delivered straight to your door every month using an in-depth online questionnaire to understand your areas of concern alongside images of your face, and then the Dermatica team use prescription strength ingredients to make you a personalized formula, this one, which then targets your areas of concern. <sighs> that was easier than me trying to remember or trying to explain, because I wrote that the other day, I put it on my Instagram, my social media, but basically it's exactly what I just said, and it really is meant to tailor and target to your areas of concern, which mine, ignoring the dark eyes, is rosacea. I have suffered with rosacea before and around here. So I have some kind of redness and scarring, which is not showing up massively here, but it is there. Acne, so hormonal problems I've had. Even now I've had a hysterectomy. I still have my ovaries and I'm still having hormonal spots every month, even though I haven't got a period. I'm definitely still going through period symptoms. So I do suffer with hormonal acne and then also some scarring. So across my skin and my chin down here, especially up here and then my chin, which is where I always had those kind of main spots. I have some scarring. I don't have as many fresh ones. Usually they're kind of up here, which I think is because I'm always touching my forehead with my hair, but I, it's scarring. So I did the questionnaire myself. I put it on there. And then the experts have come back saying that this prescription of mine, which is also adjusted as you go throughout your treatment plan. And if it needs to be adapted, they'll tweak it and change it. I may butcher saying this, but I have got 0.1% of adapalene, oh, that was long, 4% of niacinamide, and 4% of azelaic acid. 
that was a mouthful so there are three a combination of three in my one here it opens up and like i said you get this once a month straight to your door and you can do one to two pumps i'm doing this every other day at the moment just because i'm treading carefully because like i said i react to things and i just wanted to yeah tread carefully and just ease myself into it there is also a dermatica so kind of support group or i would say community over on facebook which i joined so anybody who has purchased it or even before actually you can go on there and really get some kind of you know truthful comments from people which is really helpful so that was really good and a lot of people recommended try carefully maybe go every other day if you're really sensitive just do once every three days and build up to doing every day but just be careful so at the moment i am doing two pumps which looks like this but like i said every other day and then really it's just warming it into your skin and in i kind of rub in again it's pretty easy to do i avoid the eye area around and i'm kind of i especially i think focus on those areas which obviously i've had spots and my areas of concern okay and then just push on the remainder I always put this is I don't this is like a skincare thing that everyone I think does. I always put the remainder on my hands because they're always dry. So if I'm old and wrinkly, my feet will be awful, but I'll have lovely face and lovely hands. Everything else will be sagging and dreadful, but hey ho. Okay. And like I said, it comes with a little booklet, which is super helpful. How to use your personalized formula, which is then your detailed instructions of how to actually use it properly. I did read it before husband would be laughing because I never read a single instruction but I actually did read this before but here it tells you about your formula here these are the instructions of how to apply so it's only in the evening you apply this in the evening only so in the morning I do have the same skincare routine to a degree I use my Japan fusion I then use my vitamin C serum which is the healthy healthy serum I think it's going all healthy skin and then I use a different moisturizer again from beauty pie it's just a, a lighter day moisturizer you do need to wear sunscreen Obviously, I'm going to bed soon, so not going outside. I'm now getting ready for bed. So that's why they say do it overnight. And you can also layer this and put on another serum afterwards if you want to. I personally, again, I'm treading carefully, just sticking with this one. Then doing my moisturizer, which is my oil because I do get very dry skin. Hello, Jaden. Hi. As well, if you're reacting a lot to the um, serum and to your prescription, you can also mix it or layer it over the top of your moisturizer. So do your moisturizer first and then put on your prescription again if you're reacting or worried about reacting. So so I will see, let everyone know how I'm getting on. This is day, day four of using this prescription. So okay so far, but like I said, just seeing how we go. And then my last product, is this plantastic skin oil which has got let's have a look brown algae bakuchil oh, i mean how are you meant to say these words fit phyto squalene squalene blah, blah, blah. no idea personally i find it too much in the morning for me i end up looking like a shine fest and all my colleagues always love pointing out how shiny my face is i think it's glowing but apparently it's shiny so i do it says four to six drops. I do four drops because again, I mean, it's really affordable. That is about 16 pounds. Whereas the equivalent, again, I know it's probably not gonna be as good, but the equivalent over at Tropic Skincare was 40 pounds, I think, or roughly about that. So a big difference for the same size. So I press it in and that I find is my moisturizer done. And you can do it on your lips absolutely fine Jaden is climbing behind me be careful please oh gosh and your eyebrows and again on your hands so that is done and then it's really you know I like to be quick I don't I don't normally sit here like this and film and do all this with my obviously skincare routine normally it's a five minute situation in the bathroom or in the shower get it done job done but this has been working for me like I said some tiredness under here some darkness so i need to look if this doesn't improve in a couple of weeks with feeling less tired and now not being sick i will look at what i need to do for that because i don't put anything on that area at the moment i'm being careful not to put the dermatica too high because it does sting a tiny bit but i know that's because it's working and obviously skin's getting used to it i have a few spots and a few things like that but otherwise it's not too bad but i am trying to get towards clearer skin where i don't feel like i have to wear makeup when i go out somewhere if i don't want to so probably all of us want to get to that point but that's why i wanted to try this dermatica product and see what happens so 
Hope you enjoyed this quick little video just showing you what I use. Like I said in the comments below, Dematico very kindly giving me a discount code to share everyone. It is Sussex Mum and the links are down there as well. So there's a UK link slash EU and then also a US link for my US followers. So the discount code gives you your first box for £2.90 in the UK or I think the equivalent is £4.99 in the US. And then the second month you get 10% off for your second month basically. So a nice little deal so you can only pay a small amount and see if it's worth it for you and there's no time you can cancel things at any point hello Jaden. <laughs> okay so i'm gonna sort Jaden out do some dinner get things sorted because he's now excited and wants to play and do something so watch a movie um but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video i will leave all the links down below and i'll see you soon okay bye